Press A to select everything and X to delete it. Now you press Shift A and add in a plane. Maybe scale it up. Then edit mode. Right click and select subdivide. In the corner menu, turn the number of cuts up to something around 50. Now with everything selected, press E to extrude it up a little bit. Just a bit. In the modifiers tab, add in a cloth modifier. In the physics tab, enable pressure and turn it up to something around 50. Now watch your pillow come to life by pressing the space bar. Now you can apply the cloth modifier on a frame that you like. Now you can scale down on the Z axis to make it look more like a pillow. And then right click and shade smooth. In the sculpting tab, use the cloth brush and maybe scale up the size using F. Now you can sculpt in some details that you didn't get in your cloth sim. Just do this a little bit. It doesn't need much, but just a bit will help. In the shading workspace, add in an image texture node. Plug it into the base color and the subsurf color. Make sure your subsurf is turned up. Add in an image, preferably a square one. You can mess around with the settings, but it's pretty optional. Set clip to extend. And then turn up your roughness. In the UV editing workspace, press A and scale up your UVs. It helps make it look better, especially for images with repeating patterns. Now you can set up a basic scene. This doesn't really matter, but I'm just doing it to show off what it looks like. Just adding a light and adding a camera and tweak it.